Hello there, it's Eliza Bloom Robinson popping in for a quick live on this uh, Thursday afternoon, early evening here in Arkansas. First off, I want to just offer up um, just awareness, love, kindness, compassion, spaciousness for all of the people who are now being impacted hugely by the hurricane that's uh, come up through Texas, Louisiana and heading its way into Arkansas as we speak. Um, this is just one more of a series of things that is just, you know, just even hard to fathom. And so my heart goes to people in California and Colorado and New Mexico who are dealing with fire still. Um, everybody in the line of, of a storm, a natural thing that's going on anywhere anywhere in all the world because there's lots of um, lots of intensity so I read just a thought and um, a, a message and a blessing for that today so if you are not safe physically mentally emotionally spiritually get safe right just take care of yourself make sure that you are safe make sure that your family is safe if you are safe, then I invite you to join with me in holding, creating, like landing in this field of presence, in this field of love, of light, of kindness, connection, compassion, and just experience expanding it out. So let's take a moment. I see several of you are here. If you're here, let me know. I can't see who's here, but uh, let me know. Type a hi, type a where you are, type a I'm safe or I can hold space. Um, right now in Arkansas, we're getting pretty intense winds and lots and lots of rain. Hey, Richard Mirage. Great to see you. Somehow you popped up. So uh, waving. Hello. Nice to see you. So let's take a moment to really just land in the truth of our being. The truth of our being is actually the truth that is so much bigger than our being, right? Like land in the center of your being and connect to that which is both within you and so much greater than you. We call it God, we call it source, we call it creation, we call it the quantum, we call it the universe, whatever works for you. We land in that place in ourselves. We land in that place in ourselves and we find that point of stillness. So if your mind is like running amok, then just let us land in that point of stillness and you can land there by um, osmosis, by proxy, if you will. My friend Liz uses the words proxy all the time. So I'm going to land, I'm going to get into my body, down into my hips, feel my legs connecting to the earth and land in that point of stillness that actually is spaciousness. And in that point of stillness and spaciousness, I know peace, I find peace, I find ease, I find grace. And then, right? So once I find that point, and I land in it, I can begin to expand it out. So the space I'm going to land in is ease. Now, I was talking on a call earlier today, and they're like, ease, that's like, that's like fantasy. And if you, if you like work with ease, opposite of that's going to show up. But I don't quite agree. So um, what would be another word? A um, land in the field of compassion and benevolence. Ooh, isn't that nice? So we land in the vibrational frequency within ourselves of compassion and benevolence. Ooh, doesn't that feel good? Oh, that is really yummy. Compassion and benevolence. We land in it and then we align with it. So we come into coherence and resonance with the vibrational frequency of compassion and benevolence. Just feel that washing through your system, aligning, bringing you into coherence and harmony with compassion and benevolence. And once you find that, 
turn up the volume, turn up the flame, turn up, turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. And so every one of us who's um, either live or watching the recording, we land together. We lift compassion and benevolence, and then we collaborate energetically. We feel all of our energies coming together. And that strengthens the field of compassion and benevolence. And then we turn that up and we lift that up and we begin to expand it out and expand the field of compassion and benevolence to yourself. <laughs> hey, Deborah, <laughs> and expand it to your family and your friends, expand it through your life, expand it, compassion and benevolence into and through and bigger than the storms, literally and metaphorically. Expand it through the hurricane that we're calling Laura. Expand it through the fires in California. We're just expanding this field, this fabulous energetic field of compassion and benevolence. We're expanding it to encompass, to envelop, to permeate and penetrate and fill the very inner spaces of our being individually, collectively, and through the world. Expand that field of compassion and benevolence so far that the planet Earth is right in the very center of it. And look upon the Earth as a whole with such compassion and benevolence. Just notice what happens in your being. Notice the vibrational shifts. Notice the energetic shifts, the frequency shifts. And feel what it feels to be the field of compassion and benevolence. And then we turn that up. And we turn it up and we lift it and lift it and lift it and lift it and gift it to the universe. And as we gift it to the universe, we let go. And we surrender and as we gift it to the universe, that very energy, that frequency encircles the globe, moves through the universe and comes right back down into your own very being. So open to receive, open to receive, open to receive, feel the vibrational frequency moving into you, through you, transforming what is, transcending what is and in the midst of what is. When we hold this field, when we access this field, and we do it collectively and collaboratively, collaboratively, in collaboration, collaboratively, then we are impacting our world, our countries, our continents, our weather, our lives, our friends, our family, and ourselves. So I stand with you, holding a big, wide open field of compassion and beloved, and beloved, and beloved. I can't, my words are stumbling <laughs> in this moment and from this moment forward. I'm Eliza Bloom Robinson, bringing humanity now. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Please feel free to share, and I'd love to know how this experience is for you. Until next time, bye.